What's going on, YouTube? Mike O back with another TTM recap episode. I have three baseball returns to show you today. First one coming out of Birmingham, Alabama, postmarked June 15th, 2016, with a canceled stamp. He is a uh, former closer in the big leagues, had some really nice seasons, and it is Mr. Todd Jones. Four of three success in 101 days. Here we go here on a 2000 Tops card when he was with the Detroit Tigers. Signed in black. Had some really nice seasons in Detroit. Next up here on a really nice Tops Heritage card. Love these cards here. Signed in black for his short stint with the Florida Marlins. Right here is a card that came from him. It's his own uh, personal custom that uh, I guess he sends out with all his stuff. Little uh, little information on his career growing up and his faith. So thank you, Mr. Todd Jones. And then finally here on a Bowman Heritage uh, with the Tigers signed in black. Todd Jones did spend a little bit of time with the Phillies one season. Didn't really uh, work out that well. He was a late season uh, reliever acquisition. But anyway, 4-3 in 101 days from Mr. Todd Jones. All right, coming up next, this one is coming out of San Bernardino, California. Canceled stamp, June 15, 2016. It's a three of four success, returned in 11 days. I think I sent one duplicate that I had mentioned that he could uh, go ahead and keep if he wanted to, and he did that. It's Mr. Jeff Grotewald. If you can get that to uh, focus up there. Jeff Grotewald um, did not play a long time in the majors, did not play long with the Phillies, but uh, he did achieve uh, some pretty spectacular stuff in his really short time. So first up here is a stadium club, first day edition, and that is uh, it's a nice card. I think I got most of the Jeff Grotewald cards that exist, but I do need that uh, Topps card there, which would be nice to get and get signed. Right up here is a 92 Fleer Ultra Rookie card. Came out really well, signed in black. And then finally here is a scorecard. Philadelphia Phillies scorecard signed in black. So here you see it. That is from 93 score. Got it focused up here. So this is a 1993 scorecard. And there you see his numbers from 1992 with the Phillies, and then that was the only year he played with the Phillies. I think he might have appeared in a couple games like three or four years later. I can't remember uh, who it was with. It might have been Kansas City. Anyway, see those three home runs? They were all pinch hit home runs, and they were all hit within a span of like three or four days. It was amazing. So Jeff Grotewald um, should be in the memory of longtime Phillies fans. Not that he was there long or accomplished a tremendous amount, but that little stretch was Really outstanding. So Jeff Grotewald again, 3 of 4 in 11 days. Thank you, Mr. Grotewald. And finally today, I've gotten this guy before. He is a Phillies Wall of Famer. He is a nice success. Had a really nice overall career. It's coming out of Las Vegas, Nevada. And it's a canceled stamp. Postmarked in July. Not focusing well, but it's a 6 of 4 success in 99 days. It is Mr. Mike Lieberthal. Just sign this nice tops card in blue. A little bit dark spotted, but uh, overall nice. He usually uses a thin blue Sharpie. This collector's choice came out really well. It's a nice light, bright card, so the blue uh, ink comes out great. We've got this really awesome Leaf Rookies and Stars. Really nice design. Featured in a retro uniform. So I like that one a lot. Donner Studio from 2005. This is a card I thought was really neat. City Skyline in the backdrop. Signed in blue. This one might have looked a little bit better if it was done in a, um, a regular, more thick Sharpie. But overall, still a really nice success. And then he threw in two uh, index cards. They're a little bent in the corner, but... Still appreciate it. Uh, I always throw index cards in the return envelope uh, just to give the envelope a little more stability. Every now and then someone signs one or two of them. 
So the bonuses appreciate it. Uh, not asked for, but appreciate it. So guys, thank you for checking out this TTM recap episode. Please comment below. Let me know what you think of these cards. Let me know if you've sent to any of these guys. If you have, have you gotten successes? Uh, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I will talk to you guys next time. Have a great one.